Hello everybody, we're here at uh, Raven's Glass and here it comes and uh, <laughs> we're paid to get on a little steam railway, it's a miniature railway here comes the train now so we're just going to show you that Yes to get us a seat so you can film and we're facing the right way so that oh, yeah. you could do some filming. Here we are, we're on the little tiny train. Um, we're, we've, Wendy's chosen an open air carriage. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so it's better for filming apparently. Yeah. Um, so we'll see how we go. I think the uh, the engine at the other end will be turning around I think and probably coming past us on this rail here um, to uh, actually hook up at the other end of the train it's coming in this way he goes around on the turntable down there comes down one of these tracks and then connects up at the other end There's loads of um, there's loads of dogs on this train, but they're not going for free. They have to have a ticket there. Oh, dog ticket. Yep. Yeah. And it costs one. one pound fifty for Pippin to go on the train, but but she did get this given her, which I think is quite <laughs> sweet. Oh. Yeah, so, little little dog treats. She doesn't really like these, but it's actually quite good. And, and you a, have to break those up into and a tiny little, bits. And a little black bag. So yeah. that's her souvenir. Oh. And for us, it cost return. It cost twenty-seven pounds eighty. But then it, it is expensive, but it does support the. Um, it does support 29. the railway. Is it? No, twenty-nine pounds. No, twenty-nine thirty altogether. Oh, oh. right. Oh right, yeah. yes, I see what you're saying. Yeah. So and I think yeah. it takes the train journey the train journey's forty minutes, so we're braving it outside, aren't 40 we? Forty minutes each way. Each way, yes. Oh right, okay. Okay. So we'll let you know what it's like. I really like going on old trains, so and I hear the countryside is lovely because we're going by the sea. So. And Pippin's excited, she loves trains, so <laughs> but actually she did jump when the um when the train blew the whistle coming in. Oh, is it, what's it called? Not the whistle. Yes, it is the whistle, isn't it? Yeah, she was a bit... Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> but otherwise, she's quite happy with it, and I think she's hoping another jo dog joins us in the carriage, so...
after our uh, 40 minute miniature train journey, we arrived at uh, this place and found a little village called Boot and it's a sort of a historical uh, village that has a water mill uh, down that way and here's how the water mill is fed through all of this uh, all of this rushing river and we're trying to climb down the hill here's Wendy over here looking up just going to grab a couple of pictures of the uh, flowing water to let you know what that's uh, what that looks like I'll show you those now well um, I think it's just we just thought we'd just walk up here to see this and it's absolutely wonderful and I'm enthralled by it and they're looking for volunteers to help run it and of course I want to do that and I want to live in that little cottage by as well because there's something so, it's like stepping back in time, it's so, it's a wonderful thing and the surroundings, we're at the foot of Scarfell Pike, which if we did come and volunteer here I'm sure we'd be able to get plenty of practicing and learn how to climb.